After purchasing an add-on design template from the ProPhoto Design Store, you'll be taken to a page to download your zip file. If you're not taken to this page, check the email account used to purchase the design. You'll find our confirmation email with a link to download your design. Check the spam filter or folder if the message can't be found. After downloading the zip file to your computer, be sure to save it in a location where you can find it later, like your desktop. Unzip the file, and inside you'll find a few things you'll need, like an instruction file to help guide you as you modify the design template, Photoshop files for the custom graphics the designer created to give the design its unique look and feel. This might include background images, button graphics, or photo templates used to create masthead images or logos, or other specially styled content you need to upload within ProPhoto. There will also be another zip file inside, which you will upload in the following steps. Keep all these files on your computer for future use. Let's install the design template in ProPhoto. Log into your WordPress admin area and go to the Manage Design screen. You'll find this as an option under the ProPhoto group on the left in WordPress. If you don't see this group, be sure you're logged into WordPress with an administrator account and verify that ProPhoto is installed and set as the active WordPress theme. This Manage Design screen is where your design templates are found. Each of your designs are saved here as you customize the look and feel of your site. You can switch between different saved designs anytime you want to change the look and feel of your site. To install your new design template, click the Upload Design Zip button over here on the right. In the pop-up, click to find and load your design file from your computer. Click the Upload button and wait while the file uploads into ProPhoto. When complete, you'll notice the new design template in the list. You can start with a fresh copy of this template anytime by clicking to create a new design. Let's do that now. Here you'll see your new design in the inactive designs area. These designs are each separate collections of pro photo settings and images ready to use. You can copy them, edit their title or description, and even export them as a zip file, which you can transfer to another ProPhoto setup. Let's activate the new design by clicking this button. The new design is now applied to the site. And you'll notice the site has a new appearance. The ProPhoto Customize areas can now be used to make any changes that you want for the perfect look. Don't forget that with ProPhoto, you're in control. You can use the other files that you unzipped to your computer in the earlier step to make any changes to the graphics that this design uses. If you have questions about modifying this new design, you can contact the designer directly. You'll find their contact information in the file included in your zip package.